Hi everybody, Bob the Broker, and I am recording today from our spacious two-bedroom apartment. Uh, at some point we'll talk about living arrangements when you have one of these rental what, 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 what? Hold, hold on, hold on. Hello? Uh, oh. All right, all right, all right, well, let, let's do it. I guess that's what we have to do. Okay, thanks. Uh, sorry, that was the uh, contractor calling. You know, when the phone rings and it's the contractor, it's... Uh, always a little bit nerve-wracking because you know it's one of three things and, and two of them are never good one of them is always positive and that it'll, you'll be surprised what the positive one is because uh, you wouldn't think that's positive so let me uh, give you an idea so there are three things that uh, basically when your contractor calls you they're calling for the positive one is uh, I want to get paid you would think that would be a negative one, I know, but when you do a rental loan, we put the funds for all the renovations into an escrow account. And when the contractor hits certain milestones, we put in for a draw and the contractor gets paid. So the, the quicker they want to get paid and the quicker they do get paid means your project is moving along quickly. If you're not getting your contractor paid and they're not getting that phone call too often, you know the project is dragging on. So that's the positive call. The, the negative calls are one, um, Houston, we have a problem, and those are the worst. So we've had a couple of those, even right from the beginning, when they started digging the foundation, they found an old septic tank. And uh, what does that mean? It means more work, someone, and more expenses. It was a old, full septic tank, and they had to bring in uh, someone to drain it and, and remove it. The uh, second call we had like that was when they removed the siding and found out we had nothing under the siding. So uh, it's not surprising how cold our winters have been in that house. Uh, it's just going to be more cost because when they put the new siding up, they have to put uh, basically have to put plywood up to, to all over the house, uh, additional costs. So that's the call number two. And the third call you get is uh, it's time to take the next step. Go get this done. Uh, for example, the when they wanted to frame, they needed to have our final kitchen plan. So we had to rush out and make sure we made a decision. Uh, we'll talk about some of those decisions later on, but you have to be quick with decisions if you want to keep your project going. That's all for now. Um, but, uh, you know, hopefully we won't get too many of those calls other than pay me. And the rest of them will be quiet for a while. I uh, hope all is well. I look forward to showing you uh, the... Um, the rest of the house as it gets built, and I'll talk to you soon.